Hello, you're welcome to HPPC TV, where you're equipped with God's word in finding and fulfilling your purpose. Click on the subscribe button below and turn on the notification bell to be notified on new posts. Don't forget to like the video if you have been blessed. Thank you. <music> the situation when the holy holy spirit comes there must be changes mm -hmm. praise god Hallelujah. so i want you to desire to have the holy spirit more than any other thing is it miracle you are talking about is the work of the holy spirit mm -hmm. there is no man that is uh, oh uh, you are the one that we uh, the, the miracle worker no it is the holy spirit that is doing the miracle in the life of a person that god has given that anointing Mm. It is not the power of that man or that woman or mm. that pastor or that bishop. Mm. It is the power of God, power of the Holy Spirit. Through the anointing, through the electromagnetic feed of the power of the Spirit of God that moves into that man. Mm. For example, when Jesus was in the midst of crowd and he noticed that uh, uh, that woman with issue of blood just touched her, him, if he, he feel the anointing, praise God. Mm. He feel that something has gone out. Mm. That's a little magnetic feed. He didn't talk. Jesus, you know, he didn't know the woman, mm. but he felt the power. Oh, something is gone here. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I pray that God will open our eyes of understanding. Amen. Will give us also wisdom and the ability to discern. Amen. Discernment and all these things, they work together in the power of the Holy Spirit. They are all the gift and the grace that mm. God has given us through the Holy Spirit. Mm. Praise God. He said, the virtue has gone out of me. Uh, it's like somebody touched me, he said, ah, everybody is touching you here. But mm. he all knew that it's, it's a different touch. Mm -hmm. Praise, Praise God. God. Hallelujah. That's exactly what is happening. Mm. I pray that today, there will be a different touch to your situation in the name of Jesus. Amen. The Lord will surprise you. Amen. He will get you to a situation that 
every other person may not see, but you will see further Amen. and than even the normal and the ordinary in the name of Jesus. Amen. So that means the that grace, that enabling power is deposited, is resided in the person of the Holy, Holy Spirit. Spirit. Praise God. Hallelujah. Without the Holy Spirit, we may not be able to achieve much in this world. Mm. Because some people have this, uh, they have access to this electromagnetic power without the power of the Holy Spirit. That's why they are tending to using it negatively. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise so God. I want you to decide the Holy Spirit because that is the only thing that can help in your situation. Mm. So Jesus further continued with that woman. The woman said, Ah, this time that you are said unto him, Sir, give me this water and attach not. Neither come did that to draw. Jesus said unto her, Go call thy husband. Mm. What are we talking about? What is he talking about? Praise God. But because that's a Jesus has seen something further in that woman, apart from the issue they were discussing. Mm. The woman answered and said, I have no husband. Jesus mm. said, You have you are you are saying the correct thing. Thou hast well said. I have no husband. Like I told you, the Holy Spirit, you cannot hide in the presence of the Holy Spirit. Mm -hmm. The Holy Spirit is the revealer of every secret. And the Holy Spirit told, told her through Jesus, said, Thou, for thou hast had five husbands, mm -hmm. and him whom you now hast is not even thy husband. Mm -hmm. ha. Mm -hmm. In that you have said truly what you are. Say, I have no husband. Meanwhile, she has married five. And mm. has do, he now is living with uh, cohabiting with somebody. Praise God. Mm. And that's exactly what is happening today. Many have lost hope in the area of marriage. But the Holy Spirit can help you mm -hmm. to find the right man, to mm. find the right woman. Mm. Never in any area. Even the Holy Spirit can help you to change out your children that are giving you problems. The Holy Spirit can touch your husband, can touch your wife. Anything can happen with the presence of the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit holds the key to the dynamism of the world. He holds the key to solving problems. He has the tool to solving problems in his hand. Mm -hmm. If we give him his place, he is going to perfect everything that concerning every one of us in the name of Jesus. Nobody told that woman that Jesus was a prophet. Immediately he said, the woman said unto him, Sir, I perceive thou art a prophet. Can you imagine? He started another story, and our father worshiped there, and they say we should not worship there. She said, forget about that. What is important, that's what we want to look at now. What is important, woman, believe me, the hour coming, when you shall neither in this mountain, nor at Jerusalem, worship the father. You worship, you know not what. We know what we worship, for salvation is of the Jews. But the hour coming, and now is, when the true worshippers shall worship the Father in spirit and in truth. Praise God. Hallelujah. For the Father seeketh such to worship. When we allow our spirit to walk in tandem with the Holy Spirit, oh, there will be miracles, there will be signs and wonders. Things shall begin to happen. Then verse 24 says, God is a spirit. So you cannot even separate them. God and the spirit. And they that must worship him, must worship him in that same uh, level of, uh, of, of grace and understanding. Hallelujah. Was worshiping in spirit and in truth. And as many people as worship God in spirit and in truth, oh, you become a darling of God. Amen, somebody. Amen. God will give you a pet name. God will reveal what others cannot see. Hallelujah. All the names of God in the Bible. Mm -hmm.